In this video, we will cover HTML list. There are three types of HTML list, unnumbered, numbered and definition list. Let's start with unnumbered or bulleted or unordered list. To create such a list, you enclose the content within a UL tag. Within it, each list item is enclosed with LI tag. UL tag has one attribute type. The default value for it is disk, which is a solid circle. Other values are circle, square and none. Let's see this in an example. In this first example, we have not specified any attribute. So by default, disk is being displayed. In next example, let's use circle as the attribute. As you see, disk is being replaced by hollow circle. Next, let's use square as the attribute. Automatically, the bullet type has now changed to square. Now, if you give none, the content is still indented, but it shows no bullets. Next, we will cover ordered list or numbered list. To create an ordered list, you enclose the content within OL tag. Each list item within it is marked with LI tag. Ordered list or OL has two attributes. First one is type, which has the values of 1, capital A, small a, capital I, small i, 1 being the default. Let's use this in an example. In the first example, we have not specified any attribute. So by default, it has taken Arabic numeral. Next, let's use capital A. This gives us alphabetical list. We can use small a if we want the list in lowercase letters. Similarly, if we use capital I, it gives us a list using Roman numerals. We can use small i if we want the list in lowercase. Let's cover the second attribute which is start. It can have any numeric value. It is used to specify the starting value of the integer counter. You can use normal numbers and you do not need to specify in alphabet or Roman numerals to match with text. Next, we will cover HTML description or definition list. It will display elements in definition form like in dictionary. Description list is enclosed within DL tag. Each list item has a DT tag to define data term and DD tag to define data definition or description. Let's see this in an example. If you see, the definition is displayed in new line and is indented. You can also nest other tags inside it. For example, if you want to make definition term bold, you can also nest a list within another list as shown in this example here.